Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to the final episode of Crescent and Stars BTW. I just did something really stupid. Well, really not now, kind of like 20, 30 minutes ago. So I had just finished Pokemon and I was getting ready to watch this. And so I'm like, okay, I just got one episode of this to watch. And I have the video. It starts up a little bit. I hadn't even done like my thing yet. And I look and I'm like, why does it say 25 minutes when it's supposed to be 40? Your girl accidentally made a file of the, the freaking last episode of Banner. So, woo, I think I ain't get spoiled on anything. But <laughs> it was a very good little laugh that I had for a couple of minutes. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get started with the final episode in 3, 2, 1, go. Ah. <sighs> So we don't get no intro tonight. You know what? I, and honestly, I'm okay with that because it's the last episode. We don't need that. <laughs> oh. So we had a theme. Y'all got out of a theme park? Bruh, what the fuck? It's crazy. Okay. No. Oh God. But that wouldn't be fair though, but I get it. Oh damn, poor penguin. Why not? Well, I don't think it's Lafayette or you know, Jean Toe. Oh, of course that's through somebody else and they're just going to blame them. Or you could have just ran in. I mean, that would have been better.
All this for two kids. Hell, not even kids. Teenagers. Oh my god. And it's too dangerous. You want to die? No, don't. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh, shit.
Sonic Force. Oh my god. I love the fact that you can ask you questions, but this is the wrong time to ask. Oh my god. I know, I'm sorry. You did good. Mm. Oh, well, damn, I didn't think that was gonna happen, but okay. Shit, make it. Come on, come on, come on. <sighs> Shit. Car? What car? See, you say that. And so that's why you're so upset with them. I mean, at the end of the day, she is still...
So he not gonna get arrested or anything, cause I mean, you know, you shot a child. I mean, cause um, that that is abuse, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I, I think we all can say that's a little bit of abuse, even though that ain't his kid, but still, you don't fuck with anybody, other, anybody else's kids. I, I would have grabbed that gun and just killed him. Right? I don't think y'all, yeah, exactly. You don't want to be involved slash killed. And that still be either in a, a, a grenade or a smoke bomb? Sensor minds. Smart though. Yeah, but that dude still might come after. Probably. Mm. 
Yeah, and if they split up now... Seriously? True. So then you're telling me their body is just floating in space for all eternity? Okay. He's le- he's not leading them to them though. Yeah, but you might die though. Oh, so that's where the preview was from. I mean, because, like, when you see the preview, you're like, okay, y'all are stuck in something. No, because something tells me they're going to launch, like, a whole bunch. Yeah, because seeing this preview, I thought they were, like, stuck in something else. Not a freaking coffin. Oh, my God. But they did say You would,
Well, cause yeah, they Avengers was crazy as fuck. Shit. Hell, Jinto could have died, but thank God. I bet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you just didn't know it until now. Well, damn. I thought at least he would get to see his dad again, but bro, what the fuck? No. So you guys won't see each other for a while? Oh, of course. Mm. 
Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like that something tells me when this whole series is gonna be done, he's gonna die, and she's still gonna look the same, and I'm gonna cry. Oh. That's it. Wait, wait, wait. We have eight minutes left, though. Okay, fuck it. So final thoughts on the first season. I mean, I really enjoyed this a lot. I, I think this was really underrated. And even though we're nowhere near done with this yet, there's still more to the story. But really, right now, it's just like, it's not a goodbye. It's just see you next time, aka next week. But oh, God, like, I'm glad nobody out of these two died. It is said that so many people who helped them either did possibly die, actually did die, or they're just like, probably got arrested or something. But who oh got this kind of gave me, especially the way this guy was in this last like few minutes, like Jesus Christ, and I cannot believe I'm going to talk about this. And I think I've possibly already talked about it before with this series racism and ish and the way he was just talking about Abba's in general and saying that he's disgusted with them and that he doesn't care for them and da 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 even almost making Zafayu like take her clothes off in front of him I'm like oh, wait, 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 wait. time out time out this is still a child this is still a young girl like no but because of the fact is he doesn't give a shit about her he's just looking at her essentially like an object not as a, she's still, in a way, she's still a human, even though she's of a different species, but not as a person. And if it was me, I would have killed him on the spot. I'm sorry. This was a really interesting series. Very different from anything that I've watched from 2016 up until now. I mean, yeah, it still gave me kind of like a little bit of feels to Darling and any other type of science fiction as type series it gave me feels to star wars even though i'm not really into star wars like that and i've only watched like 30 minutes of the first movie and i i couldn't take it i i tried and i i vowed that day to never try again <laughs> that was just me um hell you kind of gave me star trek vibes as well even though i've only seen i think i've seen the first season of star trek Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Because it, it's been a long fucking time. But yeah, I mean, honestly, this was really, really, really good. I mean, you end on a high note, but I, I mean, seriously, like, it, there's got to be a preview. There's six. Okay, there we go. Like, six minutes left. Like, come on now. No, the biggest thing is, like, is Jinto going to have the same voice? Or is he going to sound more older-esque? I mean, because he's going to... It's three years later. Oh, well, at least you got your spaceship, though. <laughs> hey, it's something better than nothing.
Of course. Yeah, once again, this is really underrated. I, I can't even imagine watching this. It, like, this came out in the 1990s, right? So, I was I was baby. <laughs> I was baby. Probably more toddler-esque than baby, but I was still baby. Um, watching this, and possibly even not knowing if the show was going to get a second season and such. But it makes you wonder, like, especially with the... I think we have two more seasons with this show before I'm done with it. Um... We're going to see more war as with it and everything. And I think we're also going to see both Jinto and Lafi's relationship, you know, possibly expand to New Horizons. Because, like, half of me can kind of still see these two be together by the end of the series, typically, even though there is, like, little to none romance moments between the two. There, There's, like, sometimes, but they're very subtle. Like, the moment with them in the coffin and stuff, like, that, even though, like, you didn't know what the heck was gonna happen, it felt very, like, a subtle romantic moment, even though you're like, okay, like, what the fuck? But still, I mean, out of these 13 episodes, they've had a lot of good and bad moments with each other. I mean, <laughs> I loved it regardless. And I think, you know, even having them 
in like going back to three years prior and seeing them talk with the cat one last time and just going into a flash for I mean not a flash forward a flashback through like everything from episode one up until the last episode and such was really interesting because you got to see a little really blah, 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 I cannot speak a little mini recap <laughs> Before these two say their goodbyes, and eventually three years later, she's now a captain and such. And so now they're working together again, and they can't really, like, say their first names around each other. Well, well, around others, because, of course, like, that's not professional. So, you know, you gotta say it by your captain it's like that. But when they're alone, that's where they really, truly really get to have the little times that they have together. And honestly, it's sweet. I mean... Oh, God. This ended on a high note. So, it's I'm really excited to see how these next two series are going to end specifically because you can end on such a good high note and then, like, however, like, season two is going to go and season three, they could possibly end on a high note, but not as good as this one. But we ain't going to know until we start that. But still, this was a really good finale and honestly, I cannot wait to see more. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards, well, the finale of Creston. <laughs> Of Christ of the Stars. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel and make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for Patreons. And next Thursday for everybody else for episodes 1 and 2 of Banner of the Stars. Because I think that's the next one after this one. So I will probably go check before I get ready. Probably while I'm editing um, Pokemon. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!